is up, Star Wars fans? Welcome to the Star Wars Stop. This is going to be an insane Palpatine streak. So much fun. This is the new nighttime Naboo map that just got added to the game. And I ended up getting 118 eliminations with Palpatine. And it is so much fun. And I think the only thing that is missing from this video to make it even better is a freaking skin for Palpatine. Because he didn't get any skins in this update. And that would have just completed this kill streak and made it that much more fun. Naboo is one of the best maps for getting kill streaks with any hero. I think I've gotten my 100 plus eliminations with Bosk and Ivan Versio on this map, if I'm not mistaken. And so now Palpatine joins the, the list of heroes that I've gotten 100 plus streaks with on this map. It's just insanity, man. But this, again, this is the new nighttime version. And I'm not a big fan of nighttime maps, so I typically will use the easy mode heroes on nighttime maps just to make my life easier because it's hard for me to see things on nighttime maps. My eyes aren't that good, guys. So I do go for, when I, when I saw this is going to be nighttime Naboo, I immediately said, okay, I'll grab Palpatine as soon as possible and go on an insane streak with him. And it was a lot of fun. I, I didn't play very cautious in this game. I just said I'm going to go balls to the walls and try and do as many eliminations as possible. And we were able to get quite a few hero kills too, I believe. But we're just slaughtering these poor clone troopers. It's a damn shame they didn't release a skin for Palpatine. Because I definitely would have gotten it. And I can think of some pretty good ones. Like, I mean, he, he wears that red um, outfit at the end of Revenge of the Sith. That would have been a really cool one for him. I really don't know what else they could do. Or they could give him a cane in a skin or something. Or they could give him a little... I don't know, man. Um not really much they can do but that red outfit would be pretty cool that could be a sick uh, skin for him yeah I mean I'm not going to commentate the entire video but I'll just give you some tips on how to get massive streaks with Palpatine I mean it's it's literally one of the easiest heroes to get huge kill streaks with I would not be surprised if another nerf is incoming to him but I think I don't know man if, and now that his star cards are maxed out he's just so freaking good it's not even funny how fast you can mow down these enemies and it's not even like he's a gun wielder so he doesn't really need to aim too much you can kind of it aiming is easy it's easy to aim this light i don't know if you know what i'm saying it's a little bit harder to aim a gun than it is to aim palpatine's light so that's one of the things that makes him so easy to use but if you're just i, I literally got a message on xbox after after this match from someone from the enemy team and i think they said like you play this game too much or something like that and i'm like yep it's that and palpatine though to be honest because this guy is just god and this is one of the best maps to use him on now in this beginning part you do need to be a little bit cautious because you can get separated from your team and gunned down pretty quickly but in the last part of this map, when you're inside the palace itself, it's it's like a narrow corridor and all the enemies are just sardine packed into it. And you still need to be obviously very cautious in there because you can get caught off guard by their whole team. But it's just a nightmare for the enemies if you're playing this guy because if they all bunch up, which they have to at that part of the map, they're just going to get chain lightning to death. And it's insanity. God, I, I'll have a full guide on how to completely demolish with Palpatine coming out pretty soon, but I just wanted to upload this gameplay to showcase the new map and showcase such a nice big streak with him. Now, I'm probably not going to play too much Palpatine anymore, to be honest, because it's getting kind of cheap at this point. I do want to work on, you know, just having fun with some of the other heroes. I really like this map. I like those touches, those lights. See, I... I I'm typically such a hater of nighttime maps because it just makes it hard to see things, but I feel like they did this map well because you can still see what's going on because it's not super late at night in this map, and there's a lot of lights on in these buildings that just provide some light to the map, so the lighting is good. Oh man, this is where it's gonna this is where it really gets ridiculous once we get inside here. And I remember at one point like I was I, I didn't expect this to get all the way up to almost 120 eliminations i i expected it to be you know like an 80 or 90 elim game maybe 100 at the most and then i look at the score i, I realized at some point i'm like 
this is this is getting up up there. There's gonna be a lot of kills, and sure enough, when I looked at the score, I was like, holy hell, we're touching 120 here. But yeah, it was it was a lot of fun. If you are, I don't know, there there's a couple of villains that are really good on this map. They're all pretty good on this map. I I, I think Aiden, Boss, Palpatine, um, might be the three best, just because this is a map where everybody bunches up, and they'll. All three of these heroes have really good, or villains rather, have really good AOE killing potential. But, yeah man, I mean, I, again, I have a full guide on how to own with Palpatine coming up pretty soon. So you guys can watch that for more tips and tricks on how to destroy with Palpatine. But enjoy this new video on this new map. Um, it's a really fun streak and it's it gets really hectic once we get inside there. But yeah, 118 limbs with Palpatine on the new nighttime to move map. Super fun. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Be sure to rate, like, comment, subscribe, and again, you can watch the entire gameplay if you like. Have an awesome day. MTT in position. Phase one complete. 16 seconds ahead of schedule. Target nearby clones and prepare for phase two. I predicted. Defend myself.
and programming have triumphed. The palace has fallen, as has Naboo. 